today we are going to be working on this hat. So let's get started. row 65 so here we go now at the beginning of row 66 that's the last needle row 65 uh, on needle one the one is just coming up there we're going to move the arm and we're going to push it forward to here and this is where we start wrapping two needles so we'll be wrapping these two needles and then knitting needle three and we'll do that all the way around the bed for 18 rows so here we go. What I find is if you pull two needles up and make sure this needle is very, very slightly higher than that one. And you just take a yarn, take a yarn, round, back around. And again, from mistakes, make sure that you've got it hooked right under these the hooks of the needles here. So crank forward, and as that one comes up, the needle three comes up, put the yarn underneath. And as the two needles next come up, again slightly higher than that one, you uh, should be able to do it with one hand. Wrap around, make sure that the yarn is underneath the hooks. Crank around, and under the next one. And we'll do this for the next 18 rows. wrap two and this is like um, Karen's lazy links wrap two and again it helps if this needle is ever so slightly higher than that one and again ensure that it goes under these hooks here wrap two wrap two all the way around the bed of the machine So now we're going to start the double wrap again now from needle 47 and 48. And this is what we do all the way around the machine.
Thank you.